hey, y'all. Y'all come in, and as you come in, please smash that like button. Please smash this like button. This was one young lady who I admired when she was in the Kanika Jenkins case. I felt that she was stronger than what she was and who she is, was then. I knew she could be uh, uh, stronger than what she is, and she made a big change in her life. But I wanted you to listen to to this and then I'll take you back to who she really is. What type of father I am the Lord is saying in this moment. Now this video is for teaching and educational purposes, educating purposes, because there was a change in her Lord Savior and the power of the glory that brought her to where she is than what she was then, where she was then. So she is a witness that I ran into again on YouTube. He says, I'm not that type of parent. I'm not the type of parent that you see on Love & Hip Hop. I'm not the type of parent you see on BET. I'm not the type of parent you see on VH1. The type of father I am is I will never leave you nor forsake you. The type of parent I am is I will love you until the ends of the earth. And even after that, I will love you and care for you and protect you. This is my job. She's a completely different person. She's a completely different is who she is. She was a real person. A real person. There's not two or nothing. Don't have y'all think that. But far at Now, this video, she was doing a lot of things that she wasn't supposed to be doing. But she made a change now in her life. And she's change from better from where she is where she was right here at the hotel incident and I'm going back and forth because I'm giving it to y'all at all angles and that hotel that wasn't her in that hallway we know that but the more we dig in on that the more they put these people into the mix. People like me. People like um who's that guy with the with the yarn twist in his hair. That's what he had Kanika's jeans. They put they they target us. We're we're in a I'm in a game stalking program. I can't even go to the store without people following me. I can't even sleep. I can't go to with my son nowhere. Now, this is Azaria, y'all. She was on the Kanika Jenkins uh case. And she's telling you what she went through then which now she's a different person, which therefore these people can change in the Kanika Jenks case if they change from where they were then and better now. See how she changed from where she was on that video I just showed y'all to... Um, where she is now. And I'm proud of her. I'm proud of her. And I see a big change in her. Guys, this is a prophetic warning, all right? This is a prophetic message that was given to me from the Father. I want to say, before I start reading this, y'all, if you do not have a relationship with Christ, mm. please stop what you're doing. Mm -hmm. repent right now and get a relationship with him because he is he's extremely close he's extreme he's extremely close okay and, and you know that see, see how she is that is so beautiful 
this is so beautiful. So through anything and through it all, through your highs, through your lows, through your happiness, through your sadness, through your worry, through your indifference, I'm always going to be there, but I need you to have faith. I need you to have belief. I need you to walk by faith and not by sight. Don't, don't allow your, your situation at the moment to get you in despair. Don't allow your situation at the moment to distract you from what the Lord put you here for. You've been going this long. You've been lasting this long. And it now, this is another one. One can make a friend, Monifa. She is another one that has grown up. And hopefully she has uh, matured. Uh, uh, one minute, I think she was, had a little baby. But I don't know. But I see a change in her. And I hope it's for the best. You know.